As the players count down to tomorrow to make the journey to Christchurch, the team is unison in one aspect and is that they need the full support from all the Fijian faithful. Yeah, the, only my message to the players back home, uh, just uh, please to support our team because it's the uh, first time that uh, we're going to the World Cup. We don't know what is a World Cup will be like. The Rewa duo, who will be coach Frank Farina's key man in the first game against Germany, understand the task on hand is the biggest to date in their short footballing career. I'm really excited uh, to be playing in the World Cup. Uh, it's actually, it's the first time for Fiji team uh, to qualify for our World Cup and uh, I'm also proud to be part of the historic team that uh, qualified the uh, uh, last year, uh, for me, uh, it's uh, it's a big exposure uh, playing in the World Cup. And while the talks of playing Germany are on every football fan's mouths, the players have reiterated that the weather is their enemy number one right now. This more so as the juniors have never faced anything as such before. It's uh, very cold, and uh, uh, I think uh, that they uh, the boys can adapt to it, and. Uh, I think uh, when you go to Christchurch, uh, the boys will uh, do their best and uh, perform well. The weather here, uh, it's very cold. Uh, well, it's just, we can see it's just sunny and uh, cloudy, but the weather here is very, very cold. Uh, we, we are adapting uh, to it uh, very well. Uh, I think uh, come Monday next week, uh, playing against Germany, uh, it will be a very different story for us. The cold of Auckland will be forgotten tomorrow because the team travels to Christchurch and like Waranivalu and Vervo, all the players need to adapt and get ready for what lies ahead because it will be a very cold and a very tough tournament. Interesting FBC Sports.